Welcome back to Real Life Letters. I'm Tony Bruno. This is the final chapter in the story of love letters from Mary Louise to Sweet Ramon. Now, very recently, Mary Louise had wrote me a short letter, basically going over the reason why Sweet Ramon had to leave his wife and child. Now, this story starts in September of 1967. They met at a community college school bus stop. Their first date was November of 1967. They were engaged to be married in January of 1968 and then married in June of 1968. They had their child, Little Ramon, in January of 1970. Now, we're going to skip ahead to April of 1974, and that's about the time when these letters were written to Sweet Ramon from Mary Louise. Now, it seems that Sweet Ramon had got himself in a little bit of trouble. He had fled the Mobile County Courthouse to avoid going to prison for possession of marijuana with intent to distribute. Now, she said, it's a really, really bad thing to do in the 70s. So what did Ramon do? He fled. He went south, went to Florida. While his attorney, David, who was mentioned in these letters, did what he could to keep Ramon out of prison. But now the FBI was looking for Ramon. They had contacted Mary Louise a few times, and they finally found him in January of 1975. He was sent to prison. He was released on a work release and then paroled in 1977. Now, obviously they had reunited. They had a second child born in 1978 and a third child born in 1985. Now, she does mention here he was living with another woman in Florida. So what she says here is that she loved him, but he was using her. However, he did have feelings for her also. She was very different from me. His mom, big mom, used the term about Ramon. He wanted his cake and to eat it too. Now we're going to go back here real quick and... Sadly, I do have to say that Ramon died in 1999. What she does say, though, is Ramon never abandoned me. After more than 30 years of marriage, Ramon died in February 1999. I still wear his wedding, his wedding ring to this day, 20 years later. He was the light of my life, a gift from God, and I know he's watching over me. Well, there's the rest of the story. I'm sure you're as surprised as I am. I'd like you to go ahead and comment if you would. Go ahead and like and share this video with everyone you know. Please subscribe to my channel. Also, you can find me on social media, on Twitter at T21Surfer and on Instagram at T21Surfer. One more thing, go ahead and keep sending your letters to reallifeletters at gmail.com. Again, that's reallifeletters, one word, at gmail.com. And let's bring your story and your letter to real life. I'll see you soon.